Hi, my name is Brendan. I didn't catch your name. Caesar. Caesar, hi, how are you? I'm doing well, yourself? I'm doing pretty good. Thank you for asking. Thank you thank you so much for asking. So much. It's my pleasure. <laughs> what can I help you with? Um, I was looking to to book a book a room and stuff, and because my friend recommended me to you guys, I'm actually going to be in town. Not, uh, I think next week, next weekend actually, not this weekend, next weekend, because next weekend's like now. Um, but next weekend, and I was just seeing what you know your rates and availability are and, and stuff like that. I'm really, I'm kind of new to this new hotel thing, and he said you guys were like very people friendly and stuff. So. Let me get you over some reservations, and they can give you a little more detail on exact rates and, and availability for uh, whatever you need. You're looking for. You would do that for me? Yeah, sure. Just. Oh my God! Thank you so much. Hotel reservations. My name is Kim. Hi, my hey, name is my name is Brandon. How are you? Good. Um, I'm getting a really bad echo. Echo. <laughs> <laughs> um, what was your name one more time? My name is Brandon. Let me let me see. Let me uh let me get closer. Is this better? Uh, yes, sir. Cool. What's your name? Hmm? What is your name, sir? Oh, my, my, name, my name is Brendan. Sorry. Sorry, I got, I got very confused at your question. Oh, not a problem. How can I assist you this evening, Brendan? I, I was looking for some uh, some rates and availability and stuff, and uh, the guy I spoke to before said that you'd be able to help because I'm going to be in town next weekend, and my friend said that you guys would be able to help. Because he, he okay, I guess he recommended me to you guys. Oh, okay. Well, what date are you looking at checking in? Um, probably uh, like exactly a week from now. So I guess next Friday, and then checking out on Sunday. Okay. So I have you checking in on Friday, the October the eighteenth, staying for two nights, departing on Sunday the twentieth. And I know what you're thinking. Why are you traveling on October the eighteenth on Friday the eighteenth? You're gonna have bad luck. But I'm not really superstitious, so. I thought that was Friday the thirteenth. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> that explains so much. I've I've always thought it was the 18th. Okay. Oh, no, it's Friday the 13th. You're good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So 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 I can travel next week. Okay. Cool. How many adults are going to be in the room, Brendan? Just me. Just you. Okay. <laughs> well, let me take a look at our availability. We are located at the Hollywood and Highland Center, which mm -hmm. is a really well, great well, me and, and a couple of my hamsters. You and a couple of hamsters? Well, we'll be okay with that. You'll be okay. Well, well wonderful. Um, <laughs> we're a pet-friendly hotel, um, and unfortunately... Is, is there, a, like, a, a limit to how many you can bring? Because I have... Well, because it's for, like, a little hamster convention that me and my friend are trying to start. So I have, like... I have I have 20 at my house, but I didn't know if there was a limit to how many I could bring into the premise. Um, usually with us, it, it, they'll be in cages, right? You, well, they'll, they'll actually be in tubes. Oh, okay. So, so um, like, I like I get there and I build a little tube city, as Michael Scott would call it. Oh, okay. Um, we are unfortunately sold out. I would love to sell you something, but we are sold out. Oh, <laughs> uh, hmm. do you have any? Well, I guess rooms for. I mean, you said you were pet friendly. Do you have any like animal rooms available for the hamsters? Um, the whole hotel is sold out, sir. Wow. That's, that's that's really yeah. strange. Um, that's like that's like the weirdest thing because it was like it was like oh, I'm gonna book a reservation. I have hamsters and then you guys are sold out. It's like that's weird. No no no. I, like as you were talking, I was trying to get these rates to pull up, and when it finally pulled up, we were sold out. That's why. See see that's um, why I'm thinking it's Friday the 18th because that that's my bad luck. Oh no. Let me just take a look at a couple other things here. Um, I'm trying to see if we have anything open like online or anything like that. So I'm checking a couple different places okay. for you. Hopefully you guys don't have any cracks because then, then I'll break my mommy's back because it's Friday the 18th. But um, you guys don't have any rooms. And I, and I would assume if you guys don't have rooms, it's, it's going to be booked up all over the place. I didn't even realize the hamster convention was that popular. I'm not entirely sure. Um... I've never heard of a hamster convention before, but there is a first for everything. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> that's what she said. Uh, let's see. Um, okay, so 
I mean, the hamster convention was was my idea because I saw that they have a convention for convicted serial killers, like who got out of prison, who did their time. So I was like, if there's a convention for convicted serial killers who've done their time, why can't there be some for Loli and Peepo, which is what I call my hamsters? Oh, fair enough. Well, I had two at the time, then they they uh they they fornicated. And that's how I got the other eighteen to make twenty. Oh my goodness gracious! <laughs> imagine, imagine like I mean, do you have any kids? I don't. Okay, so, so you haven't given birth. So um, yeah, imagine, like, giving birth, but, like, watching it. Like, like I mean, okay. So imagine, like, your friend gives birth, and you watch it, because I had to, like, help deliver the hamster. Now imagine doing that, like, 18 times, like 18 babies. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> it's crazy. I had to, like, run to the store and buy a gallon of 2% milk to, to feed the milk all of them, because there, there was 18 of them and only, only, two, only two teats, so... Oh my goodness gracious! Yeah, I took a little uh, tape, like t- t- teaspoons and tablespoons, and I just laid them out. And it was so cute; they would go over and just and just go <laughs> with the, the little hamster tongues, all eighteen of them. And I helped, I helped nurture them. Oh, yeah. Um, so they've got it hard blocked, so we can't book anything for mm. some reason. And it looks like it's the night of the 18th. That's that right sounds now. like that sounds like a movie I would watch with with my partner. <laughs> like you have something hard blocked. Hm. Uh, I do have availability on the night of the 19th. Uh, let me take a look here just to make sure. Yeah, I have rooms available on the night of the 19th. I just don't have the 18th. That's the issue. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. I don't. I don't know why they've. There's specific instructions not to um, sell any rooms on the night of the 18th. Right, because because probably all, all of the uh, the conventionees for the hamster convention, they probably have it all blocked out. Those bastards. I'm not entirely sure. I, this is something that they've sent out as far as like corporate has said. Do not sell anything on this day, this day, and this day. Mm. So, so do you so think, like, do you think, like, your bosses off. are going to go to the convention and stuff? Because that'd be kind of cool. Maybe they have hamsters. Do you guys have, is your mascot uh, a hamster? No, I don't think we have a mascot at Lowe's. I think hmm. we have a logo, but not a la- mascot. Mm. Maybe, maybe they're thinking about getting a hamster mascot, and that's why they're all going to the convention. Um, I have no idea, sir. Okay. Well, I mean, maybe you should ask if you're interested in hamsters. I mean, it's the place to be. Are there a lot of people that are going to be at this hamster convention? Oh, I, I, so I, because I sold tickets online, and we sold about fifteen thousand tickets in forty-eight hours. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of tickets. Yeah, and it's it's just for people, not hamsters. They can bring up to five hamsters each. So imagine if each person brought hamsters. That's at least like six hundred hamsters. That is a lot of hamsters, sir. Um, well, unfortunately, can I check any alternative dates for you, sir? I think, I think if, if, um, you guys can't get me in that Friday, because I'm only in town for the weekend, so I think that, I think that'll be it, but I appreciate you checking and looking and stuff. Yeah, absolutely, sir, and if we can be of any other assistance for any other dates, please let us know, and we'll be happy to look for you. Sure, yeah, and, and thank you so much, and if you, if you, if you find yourself bored, even though it's a very unlucky day, you shouldn't be traveling on the 18th, you know, just head on over, ask for Brandon, and I will, I will show you some hamsters. All right, have a good night, sir. Okay, you too. Bye.